Hey, what's up guys? It's Toxic here. And today we're going to be taking a look at four bundles that Roblox recently uploaded to the catalog. Because it seems like these bundles were created specifically to test out a feature that Roblox has been working on for quite a while. Now, as you guys can see on the screen right now, we're taking a look at a tweet from Bloxy News, which says, Roblox just uploaded four new avatar bundles with the description layered clothing base body and they attached a screenshot. However, we're gonna take a look at each one individually, and we're gonna talk about them because they're all pretty interesting in my opinion. All right, so the first package we're taking a look at is the package called Goblin. And as you can see, it looks like just any other Arthro avatar that Roblox could have uploaded. It really doesn't look like it's any different than, like I said, any other Arthro character. However, I mean, the main notable thing about this one and all the other packages we're going to take a look at is that the description says layered clothing base body. And if you guys didn't know, Roblox is currently trying to add something called layered clothing, which basically means you could put more than one shirt on, more than one pants on, etc, etc. And basically you could have more than just one piece of clothing for your shirt and your pants and all that. However, I feel like based off the fact that the description says layered clothing base body, this could mean that either A, they haven't finished working on it for every single package out there in the catalog, or you know, maybe that's not even their goal to begin with, or B, maybe it's only going to be for specific bundles that they choose. I'm not really sure. I'm pretty sure it's probably the first one though. They're probably still working on it for a bunch of other ones, but they probably just wanted to get some just completely prepared for testing. I'm not 100% sure, but that's just my guess based off of this. But something interesting about all of these packages, by the way, is the fact that 3D is completely broken for them. Like if we were to go open 3D right now for this, you're going to be very surprised at what you see. You're going to see that, yeah, it does still have the mesh of the package itself, but the texture on the entire like body itself is just completely just not there. It's just gray, which is really, really strange. And then the hat, I guess, I I'm assuming this is probably the head, if anything but this one is fully perfect. So I guess this probably has something to do with, again, the whole layered clothing part of this. Uh, maybe they haven't gotten this part down with the whole 3D stuff. I I'm not 100% sure, like I said, I'm just making guesses here. But moving on to the next package, we have Fishman, which is really, really interesting. This is a really strange looking uh, package, bundle, whatever you wanna call it. And um, again, like I said, this one also has the same issue when you go into 3D, it just turns all the textures gray except for the head here. But like I said, this is a really, really strange looking bundle. <laughs> this is definitely one of the more strange ones in my opinion, at least like compared to all the other Arthro packages out there. This is definitely one of the weirder ones in my opinion in terms of looks. But yeah, I, th I think the head is the weirdest part to me, just the way all of this looks like this just looks really strange to me. But yeah, again, I, I, I genuinely believe this could probably pass as just another Arthro package and I don't think it would really have that many people's attentions. It just looks like whatever. Like the quality is definitely there. Like I said, it could definitely pass for an Arthro package, just any other one. So it's not like these are just random test ones that probably will never make it to final release. I feel like some of these or maybe all of these have a chance at actually being you know, fully released bundles in the future. But moving on to the next package, we have Alien A, which looks really, really strange. And I mean, when I say strange, I mean, it doesn't have any textures on the arms or legs or the head or anything. And also this one doesn't have the same description as the other two bundles. This one just has dot, which is really, really strange. Like the other two said layered clothing test or whatever. This one just says dot. So I, I don't know what that's about. But something strange about this package is the fact that even though it does have textures for the arms, legs, and the head here, it doesn't appear to show it in the 2D version of the Roblox catalog. Because as you can see, we're in the 2D version right here, and it doesn't have any textures. And then also in 3D, it doesn't have any textures either. But if we scroll down and look at the included items of this bundle, you can see that the arm, the leg, the other arm, the other leg, all of these have the textures here. So if anything, I think this is just another bug that's with the Roblox catalog. I'm not 100% sure, but yeah. I mean, aside from the fact that, again, the 3D is broken, just like in the last two packages, it's really strange how the 2D version is also broken for this one. But moving on to the next and final package here, we have Roxy Female, which again, appears to have the same texture issues in 2D, because as you can see right here, the head just has absolutely no textures. But as we're going to see, um, the head actually does have textures. And like I said, the Alien A does have the textures it's supposed to have. It's just not showing in the catalog for some reason. Because Bloxy News actually attached an image of what three of these bundles look like in game. And let's go take a look at that picture now, actually. All right, so this is one of the images that Bloxy News attached in their reply to the original tweet that we took a look at. And you can see right here that, first of all, the first thing I noticed is that Roxy Female and Alien A both have actually working textures in studio. 
So I guess in the catalog, for some reason, those two just, the textures are broken. I'm not 100% sure what's going on there, because, I mean, as you saw, Fishman and Goblin both were working fine. But as you guys can see right here, we have the Fishman, we have Alien A, and we have Roxy Female with a layered clothing on. And like I said before, Alien A and Roxy Female just look a lot better now that they actually have their textures on them. But yeah, something interesting to note is that these are actually all the same like clothes here. And they're actually like altered specifically for each bundle, which is really, really interesting. Like you can see, they're all wearing the same clothes and the same hair. However, I mean, they all look drastically different. Like for example, the shoes here are much larger and wider. These are a little bit narrower and, you know, like smaller as well. And then these are much smaller as well and much more narrow than the, the Alien A. I don't know why it says Imp here. And then, of course, when you take a look at the shirt and the jacket itself, you can see what layered clothing is. You can see that the shirt is actually like, you know, supposed to be like on the character itself. And then the jacket is resting on top of the shirt, as you can see here. And you can see that the, the jacket here, especially like when you look at Roxy and Fishman because of the angles, you can see this isn't actually part of the package mesh. This is actually just the jacket itself, which is something really interesting. And again, if you look at the sleeves, you see it's not actually part of the package itself. Like if you were to wear clothes on a package itself, you would see that the clothes actually stick to the package. Well, here you can see the sleeves and then the jacket are actually sticking out. And again, this is what layered clothing is meant to be, which is really, really interesting, and I think it's really cool. But yeah, as you guys can see, Roblox is really working on adding layered clothing, but I wanna hear from you guys. Are you guys interested in seeing layered clothing on Roblox? Are you guys excited for it? Or do you guys not care at all for layered clothing and you think that this is just something really stupid? Because in my opinion, even though I won't be using layered clothing myself, I still think that this is something that's really, really cool. But yeah, that's pretty much it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time, and goodbye.